So I'm on my journey of fixing this old Apple PC with this USB bootable version of Snow Leopard I have plugged here in the back of the Mac. I came across a problem I believe that this NVIDIA video card was causing because of it being newer than the Snow Leopard image I'm attempting to install. So I unplugged it and pushed the power button down a few times to clear the board from electricity. And from this dead Mac, I'm going to take this video card because I know for sure it works with Snow Leopard. And if you're wondering why am I doing a Snow Leopard build in 2025, it's because I'm trying to recover some old Avid Pro 2 files from 2015. To remove this NVIDIA GTX 680, you got to remove these two screws right here, pull on this lever back here, hold it, then pull the graphics cards towards you to remove it and it should pop out. There you go. My plan is to take the recovered tracks from 2015 and see if I can remake them this year, which is 2025. Okay, now it's time to put in a known compatible video card. So it's gonna be a reverse process, it's taking it out. It's gonna line it up with the bottom slot and then pull the lever and lock it in. There we go. And with this card, I only need one power supply, so I'm just gonna pick one and then I'm gonna insert it right over here carefully. All right, now it's time to plug the DVI connector into the DVI port. I had to take the plastic off of this so I could run two DVIs next to each other. It just wouldn't fit with the plastic on it. Plug the power cable back in and hope to God that it turns on. Push the power button, then hold the Alt or Apple key in order to get to the boot option screen. Okay, the suspense is real. Oh no, not the red LED. Music to my ears. All right, back at square one, but with a different graphics card. But will this one work and load the installer? Fingers crossed it will. Okay, I'm going to click on the orange USB bootable option. And hopefully this thing goes through. Yes, it's working. Do you want to see my immediate reaction? Well, here it goes. All right, enough being goofy. But hey, if y'all want to keep up with the Snow Leopard rebuild, feel free to hit the subscribe button. Also, if you want to help me, hit the like button, leave a comment, and I'm going to keep y'all posted with this project soon.